Well, I'm Brady Papinga. You're here to talk about your new book. Tell yeah. us a little bit about it. Well, basically, it's a theme of my life. You know, it's always been competition from the, my youth up until this point. And so, you know, I met a, a gentleman by the name of Bo Eason, who is the, uh, a former teammate of Ted Thompson, played with the Houston Oilers. And, and by the way, if, he told me a quick story about old Ted saying, if you want to call him the king, Go the right king. Ahead. Yeah, okay. He attracted all the ladies back in the day because of his sweet blue and gray hair. Talking ah, about talking about. okay. He, yeah, he had the same color. Yeah, same yeah. color back when he was still playing in the oh, NFL. Betcha. But anyway, Bo Eason inspired me to write my book. And he just, he asked me, he just said, well, what, you know, is a theme throughout your life? And ultimately, what is something that you feel like you're an expert at? You know, and as I started sort of going through my archives and memories, I, I thought, man, the competition has always been something that has been a part of my life in one way or another. And so I decided to write on it. And I, and I talk about, the progression of how competition ultimately affected me. And because and, and in competitive situations, there's pitfalls and there are benefits. And, and if you don't have the right perspective, which there was times where I didn't have the right perspective, you just aren't able to take full advantage of all the benefits of competition. And then also my book, even though it's called The True Spirit of Competition, it shows me in football pads, it's for everybody because we're all competitors. And I talk about that, as a matter of fact, and, uh, when I went down to Uruguay mm -hmm. to learn Spanish. In order to learn Spanish and to assimilate to the culture, I had to apply the same principles that I did on the field. Okay. Well, and whatever you've whole, done, you've done yes. like 110 degrees. Let's exactly. Be well, yeah, I don't go halfway on anything. And that's right. just how I've been trained and taught. And then in the book, I talk about a, an encounter I had with a big burly man by the name of Larry Allen, who is a monster. The Dallas Cowboys. Yeah, we played the Dallas Cowboys. And I faced him. We played with the San Francisco 49ers. And then uh, really fun chapters. I talk about what made the 2010 season so special. Okay. And it's because the, the, our team was built on a culture of competition. So you got to give Ted, you got to give Mike a lot of credit for that. And then I talk about Brett and Aaron awesome. and about how competition really drove their relationship. And at the end of the day, there's no Aaron Rodgers, the MVP version of Aaron Rodgers without Brett Favre. And that's just the element of competition that it brought. Because as you, we all remember, Favre wasn't about to mentor the young guy. He made it clear that, hey, it's not in my contract to have to mentor anybody. My job is to be the quarterback. But Aaron did a nice job, obviously, of indirectly competing with Brett and learning from Brett. Because a lot of the mannerisms that, that Aaron has, man, it reminds me almost identical of him. One last yeah. quick question for you on that. When uh, you guys were on the road, two big, tough linebackers, you and A.J. Hawk, yeah. what would you do for A.J. Hawk the night before a game? You know, we, we always joke about, you know, I'd braid his hair or whatever. But, I mean, I would never really braid his hair. Yeah. I don't know how to braid his hair. But yeah. I do know how to fluff it a little bit. And, and I would feel it. I and like it. it. Yeah, and Man I, of all talents. Well, it's very interesting because here you got this tough guy. And, and Clay was the same way. But yet they took so good care of their hair. And it always smelled so nice. <laughs> And All so, right, perfect. Smells nice. And you're actually well, going to be holding a book signing tomorrow, right? Yeah, we'll Packers Pro Shop. Packer Pro Shop, D2, we'll be all over the place. Check us out on Facebook and Twitter. Mm -hmm. We'll be uh, publicizing all the places we'll be at to sign the books. Perfect. We really Always appreciate a it, pleasure Eric. to see Brave Papinga. Thank Brave you Papinga. so much. We really, really appreciate it.